Hello everyone, it's Elizabeth. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be swatching the six polishes in the Beatles Gel Gingerbread Collection. I love these colors. I think they are so pretty and soft for the winter months ahead of us, like January and February. So I'm so excited to swatch these polishes. And if you see anything that you like in this video, you can go ahead to the website. I will have the link in the description box. And you can use my code ELIZABETHDIY for 15% off your purchase. It's not an affiliate link. I don't make any money off this purchase, but if you would like to get some money off some really awesome gel polishes, then go ahead and check out that link. And if you'd like to see these swatched in real time, then just keep on watching. This first shade is 459, and this is like a creamy, taupey natural shade. This one has a great formula. It's, it is gel, so it's a little bit on the thicker side, but it's still super easy to apply. It covers the nail really well. And I'm not having any issues with it being too thick. I'm able to really get a nice coat of polish on my nails. And it is a really pretty natural, neutral shade. For those of you wondering, when I swatch gel polishes, I do have a peel-off base coat underneath my nails, so I'm just able to peel off the polish once I am finished swatching each one. But there is the first coat. I'm going to go ahead and cure this for 60 seconds and then show you a second coat. Here is the second coat. And this one is completely opaque in two. When you are applying gel polishes and you actually want these to last for a week or more, you're going to want to make sure that you have a gel base and gel top coat. But for swatching purposes, since I'm peeling these off directly after, I'm not doing that. But I would like to do a wear test. I did a wear test the last time I swatched a Beatles collection. And the polish lasted a week before I was ready to switch up my nail polish color. So I know these last a decent amount of time but I could always do another wear test because I really like these colors for the winter months. But there are two coats and this one is super beautiful. This shade is 464 and this is a really pretty soft neutral polish. Again, has a great formula. You can see it's applying really, really well and smoothly. There really aren't any streaks. It self levels really nicely. For those of you wondering, I use an LED gel lamp and I cure my gel polishes for 60 seconds. And if I can, I will find, I don't think they make the lamp that I use anymore, but I will find a link on Amazon similar to the gel lamp that I use and I can link it in the description box for you guys if you want to check it out if you're interested in a gel lamp. So there is the first coat. Here is the second coat, and this one covers completely in two. Really, really beautiful color. In fact, I really do want to do another wear test because I do love wearing gel nail polishes on my nails. I'm just the kind of person that loves changing the color I have on my nails all the time. So it's hard for me to wear gel when it lasts so long, but this might be the color that I wear for the wear test. I think it's so pretty. And also, I've been thinking about making a how to perfectly apply gel nail polish on my channel. If that is something you guys would be interested in, I can definitely add that to the list of videos to make because I love applying gel and I thought I could give you guys some tips and tricks. <laughs> but anyway, here are two coats of this gorgeous shade. Here is 460, and this appears to just be a basic white nail polish. And this one is applying similarly to the other two. I feel like it has a tad thicker formula and then is a little bit on the streakier side, which I feel like is like counterintuitive, but it still is fairly easy to apply and I think it will still build up to full opacity in two coats. But again, with gel, you want to make sure that you're applying really thin coats because that way the gel polish will cure evenly and completely. Otherwise, if you have thick gloppy coats, it might not cure all the way and then you'll be left with a gel mess and your manicure won't last as long. So 
So there is the first coat. Here is the second coat. And it does look like it covers completely in two. I feel like a white gel polish is kind of just a staple to a gel collection. I really like wearing white nail polishes, especially in the summer, but in the winter as well. So I feel like I'll start incorporating this into my manicures. I also am excited about this collection because it has a lot of colors that my roommate slash best friend will like. So that will be fun as well. So there are two coats. This is the shade 461, which is a gorgeous deep maroon, like a blood red. And this one has a fantastic formula, covers super well on that first coat. Again, this gel has like a thicker formula, but it's super easy to apply. And I really like the brushes on these polishes. They're a wider brush, so you're able to kind of paint your nails more precisely. At least wider brushes help me paint my nails. I know that's not the case with everyone. But it's also not a super wide brush, so I feel like if you have more narrow nail beds, you're still going to be just fine. So there is the first coat. Here's the second coat. And this one covers completely in two. This is really such a pretty color. And my best friend's favorite color is red, so she's going to love this one. There's really not much else to say about these polishes other than the formulas are fantastic and they're super easy to work with. I'm really impressed. So there are two coats. This is 462 and this is a really beautiful silver glitter. And that applies amazingly to the nail. It is suspended in a really nice base so the glitter is perfectly evenly distributed and this one I have a feeling will definitely be opaque in two coats. Another thing I can mention about these polishes is that they almost have no scent to them. Like they don't have a strong nail polish scent or even like a strong gel scent um, which is really nice if you don't want stinky nails because I know a lot of times nail polish can be really smelly and sensitive to some people and this polish does not have that. Here is the second coat and I am so incredibly impressed with this glitter. In fact, this might have to be the shade that I do for the wear test because I'm completely obsessed with this glitter. I love that it covers the nail completely in two coats. You can definitely incorporate this into some really fun nail art, some mixed manis, skittle manicures, accent nails, you name it. This polish has got you covered. And just look at that shine and sparkle. So beautiful. This final polish I have to share with you is 463. And this is a gold almost like a bronzy glitter. Now this one doesn't seem to be as densely packed as the silver one was, but it still has a really nice formula and the glitter is easy to apply and evenly distributed. And I think it's so pretty. This one, again, perfect for nail art, accent nails, anything you want. And that's what I love about this collection is that all six polishes go really nicely together. She could really do a nice Skittle manicure or there's just a lot of options for combinations for really beautiful manicures. So there is the first coat. Here is the second coat. And the second coat definitely builds up that glitter quite a bit, but since this one has more of a sheer base, you can still see the nail line underneath a bit. But I kind of really love the way that it makes the nails look and I'm gonna stop at two coats because the glitter is so busy that you really can't even see the nail line and it's pretty much completely opaque in two coats. But I, again, love this glitter and I'm honestly in love with this whole collection. I'm really impressed and I'm so excited. Plus, Beatles has so many collections and so many different colored gels on their website that you really can't go wrong. 
So that is going to be it for my live swatch and review of the Beatles Gel Gingerbread Collection. I was really impressed with these polishes. I think they applied super smoothly and I really loved the colors. So again, if you're interested in purchasing any Beatles Gel polishes, you can use my code ELIZABETHDIY for 15% off. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And let me know in the comments what shade was your favorite and if you think you'll be picking up any of these gels anytime soon, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!